In this video, we're going to be learning how easy and cheap it is to send SMS messages using Python. So we're going to be implementing this in Python, but to actually send SMS messages, we're going to be using Amazon Simple Notification Service. It's also extremely easy to implement. So to use Amazon's Simple Notification Service with Python, the first thing we have to do is install Amazon's SDK. So to do that, all we have to do is we type in pip install boto3 so if we hit enter now that should install if you get any permission problems just type in sudo and your password if you're on windows you can also use the pip install boto3 command so once you've got that installed we can actually just launch the python interpreter like this and we can type in our commands so before we can use amazon's sdk we need to set up our credentials so inside your amazon web services account you want to go to iam and you want to create a new user so we give them a username, I'm just going to call them test1234. We want programmatic access because we want them to be able to use Amazon's APIs. And we want to attach an existing policy directly. And the policy we want to attach is one that lets us use Amazon's simple notification service. So if we just type in SNS, we want to click on the policy Amazon SNS full access. And we scroll down to review. And if we create the user, it's going to give us our API keys that we need to actually access the service. So once we have our API keys, you can go to this page and you can follow the configuration instructions. All you need to do is run the command AWS configure and it'll ask for your API keys. And to do that, you have to install the command line interface as well. But that's really easy to install. So you can just click on that link to install it. And if you don't want to install it, you can alternatively just create a file in this location and give it your API keys that way. So once you have that set up, we're ready to go into Python. So inside of Python, we want to import that library we just installed. So once we've imported the library we just installed, we're ready to start sending text messages. So we're going to create a variable called client. It's going to be equal to boto3.client. And the client we want to give it is the SNS client. And you can see I just got an error there because I didn't specify a region. So I'm going to use the region that's based in Ireland, which is called EU West 1. So to pick a region, all I do is give it a second parameter and I'm going to type in EU West 1. And that is the client variable created. So now that we've got our client connected to my Amazon account, we're going to try to send a text message. So to send a message, all we do is we say client.publish and we want to provide the client with the phone number to send the message to and the actual message itself. So to provide the phone number, we write phone number equals and then the string, which contains the phone number. And to provide the message, we just say message equals and then the message. So I'm going to say hello world from howcode.org. And now I'm going to type in the phone number. And before we send a text message, we want to go to manage text messaging preferences and here we can provide a default sender id and you can see my default sender id is how code so we're going to send that message and now you can see the message showed up on the phone and we can send as many as we want so i just sent three messages there as you can see how quick it is and it's extremely cheap as well so hopefully now you've seen how easy it is to send text messages using python and amazon simple notification service it only actually takes us three lines of code before we're ready to start sending messages. But that's it for this video. Don't forget to like, comment, favorite, and subscribe. Don't forget to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Reddit. And don't forget to sign up to the new How Code website. But that's it for this video, and I'll see you next time.